are you? Hold on. Are you not the exact same woman who I so bravely saved from the bad man yesterday? A prison sentence of two years. Or he has to pay a penalty. Hold on, Bakia! I have been shouting your name for so long. Have you lost your hearing or what? Who's there? Show yourself! You both will never achieve true happiness, and you will yearn for your child all of your lives, Mulhad and Kalyani. My team had found some children outside the station all alone. But unfortunately, Moksh wasn't with them, though. Have you seen this man at all? No, sir. Who is he? Yashvant. He's a criminal, madam. If you have any information about him, inform the police, madam. Madam, what happened? I made an offering of milk just now, and he accepted it. She is not a thief. Actually, thanks to Muku, we now know who is the real dishonest person. So that's how the statue was drinking the milk, huh? You called all our neighbors here to show them this fake miracle that you staged for them. Bad aunt actually telling the truth. What? She said that you lost your child. Please don't cry, aunt. My dad always said that a person should always be happy and appreciate the little they have, nice aunt. Terrific. Malhar. Kalyani! I need to find the King of Himalayan Flower. Listen, a special medical doctor told me to get it for Malhad, and he said that it would help heal his wounds. He gave me the address of where I can find one. That is Sartak's address. Kalyani, that is the right flower. You and your mom snuck into my house, breaking in and broke the law. Do you think I'll let you go scot-free after that? I will tell you what will happen now. The police will come here, and once they arrive here, they will take you away from here in handcuffs. It is not seven in the morning yet. And I know the law states that a woman cannot be taken into police custody before seven o'clock in the morning. Kalyani is Moksha's mother. And Moksh deserves his real mother too. Remove her handcuffs. Anticipatory bail. Which lawyer did you get to represent me? Those papers. I prepared them. What Godavari did was illegal and wrong, so she should be punished for it and face the consequences. I don't want to go to jail. Um, it, it's all because of her, my, my, my grandmother. She, she wanted me to become a qualified lawyer. Not a single person has seen the footage yet. All right, I'll give it to him. Uh, thank you. Avni. That is all, Palu. Tell me, who is the bull made out to? Yes, I'll check now. Here I found it, madam. Look, here's the bull. The bull was made out to some Mr. Mirror. Unfortunately, there was a bad incident. When we were moving to the US, we were at the Aurangabad railway station and Moksh disappeared. He'd been kidnapped. I had an exact duplicate made of the ring and both of them fell for it. They did not even consider that he is not really their son, Moksh. Now she will never find out where the real Moksh has been all this time. I'd like to challenge you, Kalyani. Moksh and Malhar will be mine, not yours. Remember the concoction that I made you drink the other day? Mm. I think I had some of it on my finger as well. And then I must have put that finger in my mouth. And the side effects when girls use a concoction is... What? He is Shyam's son, Manu. He has been struggling in a life of poverty. If his son stayed with us as Palu, he would at least have a chance at a better life. Who told you that my father is in hospital? He is at home right now helping with wedding preparations. Huh? And the reason I'm running away is because he is forcing me to get married to somebody who I have no interest in. Madam, why didn't you open the door when we were knocking? I was in the bathroom. Are you the chef? Greetings, sir. I'm the chef and they are my helpers. If you're going to beg Almighty for something, then you better start begging for your life. And you'll die very soon. <coughs> Can I get some water, please? I'm so thirsty. 